All right, guys, this is Phillips Scarborough's Sub Fari. This is extreme car audio right here. Extreme. Follow him on Instagram, Facebook. So he has that good old certified base head wire in there. He's got some Wolfram Lithium down in there. Four Crossfire 16 Ks, but I think he's only using two right now. So this is what it looks like on the inside. How insane is that? Let me turn the light on. All right, so he's got four custom Crossfire Neo 18s and this extreme build. So it has this, uh, I don't know if you call it a console, but over here is where it loads all the pressure. Look at all this, isn't that insane? Still a work in progress, obviously, but this thing is killing it. What'd you do yesterday? I did a 180.1 and DD Drive and a 181 in Utah. <laughs> like it's nothing. <laughs> it's like I'm uh, on uh, half power, right? Yeah, I was on two eights. Had an issue on the first run. We wired up to half on two eights and did a higher score. That's insane. So as you can see, his windshield's been totally modified. Again, this is extreme. I don't know what this is right here. Hey, Philip, what's on this front windshield right here? This material right here? That's just Bondo. It's garbage. So okay. It's, uh, so there's steel under it, and then I just put Bondo on top of it to fill Go. it in. A little bit of aesthetics. Yeah. <laughs> How thick is the windshield? Four inches. Four inches. I said, I said maybe two inches on uh, my Instagram. Yeah. Obviously, I was totally off. This two is inch two inch side windows and four inches inch windshield how insane is that look at this absolutely crazy my favorite part is this trailer wheel right here so in order to open the door the door is so heavy you have to put this down like this jack it up like this then you open the door and then it'll open. <laughs> That's crazy. All type of customization going on up in this unit. <clears throat> you can see all the bolts in here. It holds it shut so you can get the maximum SPL score. So this was his first time doing a 180. So that's very cool that he was able to achieve that. So if you think extreme car audio is cool, give me a thumbs up on this video. We'll see you in the next one. Later. Elijah oh. back there having some fun in that oven. Bacon. <laughs> hey, at least you got that little fan that ain't doing a dang thing. Well, it's nice hot air. <laughs> car audio fun times right here. So these are the subwoofers that are in the van. I can see them taking them out in there. Oh yeah, big time. But, so this one, everything is good on it, minus the cone. You can see the cone just exploded. This is from extreme pressure on the cone from being on that other level. Carbon fiber dust cap. It looks like they even put some epoxy or resin on the back of here to try to help out with making it more rigid, but it's just so crazy. The amount of pressure is so insane. It just exploded the entire cone. You see the tensiles there? Tensiles look good. Voice coils look good. I mean, everything's good. This is a new motor on here. I just came out with. But yeah, that's what happens when you get up in that upper echelon of car audio. It's insane. Super insane.
Pass the soup. Yep. Up, huh? Big bump. They don't weigh nothing, dude. What are they? Like 40 pounds or something? Maybe 45, 50 yeah. most. Yeah, I didn't figure they, they weigh that much. All performance. It's a straight. This is a big Neo slug right here. Absolutely crazy. Folded it. All right, guys. Hit me with that thumbs up. Heavy. It's a heavy girl.